just a little bit here. So if you go into here and go into shipping, you can set shipping zones and shipping classes um, and different products can accept different shipping zones or shipping classes. Um, currently you have any location not covered by the United States. And let's just look at shipping options here. So United States has free shipping set. Uh, we do not have any shipping classes. So what you could do is just duplicate an additional shipping zone and put Canada in it if you don't want to charge for shipping to Canada. So we're going to go in here and add a shipping zone. And we're going to say Canada. And then we're going to pick Canada. We're just going to say all of Canada. And then we're going to add a shipping method. And the shipping method is going to be free shipping. And add a shipping method here. Add and save changes. So if you want to set individual shipping classes within Canada, you can do that. So you would create a shipping class and then say like you had DVDs or something, or you had books, or you had an eight by 10 envelope or whatever. Each one of those could be its own shipping class. And then you could assign, if you create shipping classes here, those shipping classes will then show up inside of the shipping class, right? So free shipping requires nothing or free shipping requires a valid shipping coupon, right? So now you have this option to do this in Canada. There's only the title of free shipping. If you create more shipping classes, you'll see those in here as well, and then be able to add fees based on the shipping class. So right now though, I've gone ahead and set it so that when someone is ordering from Canada, it's going to give them free shipping as well. Previously, there was no free shipping option for Canada, but now you have Canada free shipping, United States free shipping. You can also set up additional shipping options if you want to. All right, I realize that's a lot. Let me know if you have questions on that. In a product then, just to show you this, and I don't know that you're gonna to need to do this right away or even at all, but um, if you wanna know how to do this, within a product, you can assign a shipping class to that product. So let's just say this was a DVD or a book or whatever. You could go into the shipping tab here and say, hey, I want to assign the shipping class. And if you had created shipping classes, you would be able to assign the shipping class to this product and then this product would take the settings for that particular shipping class. In most cases, you're just gonna set one shipping class and then it's gonna figure it based on the settings that you have set up over here for the various zones and the classes that apply within that zone. It can be a little confusing. I don't know if you're even gonna play around with all of that. I don't know if you just needed free shipping to Canada. That is how to set up shipping zones in WooCommerce and make sure that you have the right zone set up to allow for free shipping, in this case to Canada. Thank you very much. If you liked this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up below. Be sure to subscribe as we have more helpful videos if you have any questions that we can answer for you, please be sure to come and visit us at showmehowtodothis.com.